in the past, you have these applications where, where the designers create uh, awesome, beautiful designs, right? And then uh, it goes into production, and it all kind of falls apart in production because they can't implement those designs. And you have major loss of fidelity. And WPF, because of, again, the, 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 that layer of XAML in between where you can leverage a workflow uh, that allows a designer and developer to work uh, highly interactive together, you don't lose that fidelity. The challenge, of course, is that with WPF, you are uh, limited in your deployment uh, who you can reach. Silverlight allows us to have the same beautiful application, you know, uh, the, the rich application, but achieve the reach that we've been looking for. So welcome to the designer's den. We've uh, got a number of folks in this room. It, it's kind of turned into a makeshift war room as we go into final mode the last few days of integration uh, leading up to September 5th launch of, of, the, uh, of the site. It's the uh, Emmy site for Entertainment Tonight. So there's a, there's a number of different things it'll do and uh, it's built in Silverlight and uh, the virtual producer part of it is what allows uh, users to take uh, different uh, high quality videos and put them together and see different uh, and see them all played together. It comes pre-populated with uh, the latest exclusive videos so when you go into it automatically you have something to work with. You can choose how you want to watch it and what elements you want to watch. If you like it's a mashup so you can go in there and you can choose your clips and you can watch it like your own TV program. Basically, it's, it's made up of a series of templates and we try to make the system as expandable as possible. So everything's based on a series of user controls, all of which are drag aware. We have the concept of a drag manager, which understands different regions of the screen and different objects can interact with the drag manager. So you can drag a video clip to the delete or you can drag a video clip to your virtual producer and that side of things. We've got animations in terms of being able to move things around on the screen um, and have different metaphors for playing that in a very dynamic way. So you can shuffle, we call it the shuffle control, where you can sort of shuffle through the, the, the content and look at particular aspects very cleanly, very fast. And you're never leaving your current context, so you can always see what videos. So one video is playing bigger, but you can go over any of the videos and see a little preview of, of, of what's actually uh, running on that one. Entertainment Tonight already has the infrastructure for, for doing all the, this kind of videos and having, having them transformed to different, uh, to different sizes or different resolutions. The, the one thing we did uh, was work with them on how to, how to tag information so that it can be manipulated and sorted and so we can get to the stuff. So we needed to work with them on building feeds and making sure data was tagged so that it would show up properly in the application so we could consume it. They've got 30 million, some insane amount of users that come to their show every evening. And they provide this broadcast quality experience that, that is unparalleled as they, as they bring in uh, assets. I think Entertainment Tonight is very savvy in that they realize that if they're able to uh, achieve a similar uh, broadcast level experience on the web, that's going to create some stickiness for their viewers, it's going to create some happy viewers, and, uh, and that's good, good for business, right? So Silverlight plays well there because it allows us to, uh, to get near broadcast level experience on the web, right, using their high top quality assets and provide some interactivity along the way and even personalization. Send them to the web, near broadcast quality experience, personalization, interactivity, and it's it's a good thing for entertainment tonight. It's, it's a good thing for, for their viewers, too.